Well, howdy, everybody. This is John Michael. It's the third Monday of Lent. And today we hear the familiar scene of Jesus going into his synagogue, and he, and he reads, uh, and he says, Today the scripture is fulfilled in your hearing. They don't receive him. And he says, No prophet is without honor except in his own country. And then he reminds them that the people of Israel rejected Elijah and Elisha the prophet, and they ended up going to people who weren't Jewish who would accept their teaching. Wow, think of that. So what's that say to you and me? Sometimes the people right in our own church, in our own Christianity, in our own parish, they are bringing the word of God to us and we don't accept them. So they have to go somewhere else. They have to go somewhere else. And sometimes we really get infuriated by them. You know, we don't want to hear what they have to say. So we take them to the brow of the, you know, of the hill outside of town and we want to kill them. But today we don't kill them physically. We kill them with two things, gossip, slander, that's one really, and the other is just ignore them. We just are apathetic. So we kill people today too, but no prophet is without honor except in his, uh, in his own town. You know, no prophet is without honor, excuse me, except in his native place. So we have to learn how to really receive the prophets, uh, the preachers who are in our midst, the teachers. Let's receive them and let's not have them pass on and take their message somewhere else. That would be our loss, wouldn't it? So let's, let's be open to this and then we'll get the full word of God, the full message of God, and we won't want to kill them. We'll want to receive them, and we'll want to receive God's word in our life. That's my prayer for you guys. I love you. All things are possible with God.